Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today, I'll have another episode of unboxing video and today I'll be presenting the Seagate Backup Plus SIM Portable Storage Drive. So this is a 2 terabyte uh, portable hard drive and this is a very slim and lightweight. And uh, this actually supports USB 3.0 uh, including USB 2.0. And this, is, uh, this external hard drive is a very, uh, it can be a very good travel companion. So I'll be, I'll be carrying this uh, portable hard drive with my uh, next trip which is coming up on uh, next week and uh, today I'll be unboxing this video and at the same time I'll be doing uh, a sync with my laptop uh, to see if it's uh, if it works right away without any problem or without any trouble so it should work uh, or it should, I should be able to back up uh, files or transfer files uh, it should be just plug and play uh, there shouldn't be any problem but we'll uh, go through that and we'll see how uh, this product is easy to use or how difficult it is to use I'd like to mention that this is not a paid or affiliated review I purchased this with my own money so the opinions are honest and unbiased so let's get back at uh, unboxing and I'm expecting this video about uh, 7 to 10 minutes long okay so here's the drive coming out and I'll set this aside here and as you can see it's wrapped in a plastic cover so there's a small brochure and I'll put it in here and this is the backup hard drive or portable hard drive looks like so it comes with USB cable so I'll just put it here for now and let me go through some of the specs or if anything important here so it just gives you basic information how to connect and how to back up everything and let's take a look here Okay, so there's some instructions which uh, I'll not uh, go through. So let's open up. Okay, so this came out and here's the hard drive and here's the USB cable which is USB actually data cable so I'll put this aside here and let's take this out of this packaging this is wrapped in a plastic packaging and okay so here we go here we have the portable storage drive and as you can see this is very tight very small and lightweight and it doesn't feel anything at all the weight in terms of weight this is really handy and lightweight and there's something here Let me okay I, I'll try to take it out later on because it's not coming off that easily so I think that shouldn't have any problem so what I'll do let's uh, I'll get my laptop here so here I have my laptop and I'll connect this to the USB port here so okay so this should be connected right here and then uh, this should be going inside the laptop and I'll uh, connect this here let's 
so this is not actually USB port this is looks like some sort of proprietary port and it kind of looks like a micro USB but two of them together so it has to be some sort of proprietary port so just plug it in here and as you can see that the connection is on right away so it's taking connection from uh, via the USB from the uh, laptop so this message after plugging the device onto my laptop and then there's Seagate backup plus drive uh, choose what to do with the removable drive okay so I'll just uh, configure this drive for backup configure storage setting okay open folder to view files okay so I'll just choose that option so I have here start here for Mac and looks like for here I get a portable drive option which is right here so I'll just click on here and see what I can do I'll try to drag and drop my copy my copy this folder here which is YouTube music and let me see if I can remove paste this here okay so it looks like it's working so I'm just copying the whole thing and putting it into the Seagate drive uh, and it's actually copying everything right now as you can see okay so it's everything in there so what I'll do I'll just uh, remove the hard drive or portable drive and I'll try to access the same files just going inside the uh, drive again so in order to remove that let's go here safely remove hardware or eject media so I'll just click on it and here eject slim drive uh, which is right here okay so I disconnected that and it says that it is safe to remove hardware so what I'll do I'll just uh, unplug this uh, which is right here so as you can see that you know this is unplugged right now and I'm going to plug back in and I'll try to access the same files which is inside here okay so I connected it again and now I'll see try to open the folder actually it came up automatically so if I go here I can see that the YouTube music is right here and all the files I saved before is right here accessible in the drive so in terms of transfer speed uh, I gave me very good speed uh, speed uh, I'm not sure what is the speed but uh, it worked pretty well and it looks like it's very user friendly uh, I didn't have to do anything exceptional or it didn't take much time so this is uh, very compact handy and travel friendly so when you need to uh, save up save up your uh, backup files and stuff when you're traveling so definitely this is something you should rely on or you should keep on and uh, it looks very uh, cute and handy too uh, very uh, portable very lightweight so that concludes uh, the unboxing and brief review of the Seagate backup plus slim portable storage uh, if you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and uh, there will be more videos coming up. Thank you.